This video is going to show you how to limit the size of holes detected by automatic feature recognition inside of the hole manager. So I'm going to open up hole manager. Let me go ahead and just open up these tools and processes just to get you guys an idea what's going on. Adjust the stuff on my screen a little bit. Awesome. All right. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to select my solid and run automatic feature recognition. All right, so it looks good. It picked up all the holes, even these angled ones. That's great. Oh, let's go ahead and fit that again. What I'm concerned about are these two holes right here, and I'll show you what it did. So if I, let me click off the model. If I highlight those holes, go down until we find them. There, there's that one, and then that one. So you can see what it did is it recognized this big, Kind of ring as its own hole. So if I was just to create a group with that, select that group and hit auto whiz, you can see it goes ahead and drills it, but what it does is it automatically creates this crazy drill here that's a flat bottom drill that's almost three inches across. Really what my goal is is when I'm using hole wizards to create automatically create very accurate data that I can just go ahead and use not a bunch of extraneous stuff. So I'm going to show you how to limit the size of holes that AFR finds. So I'm going to go to preferences and over here on the right hand side, it says import preferences. It says maximum hole diameter. I'm going to click that. And I'm going to say, you know what? The biggest hole I have in my uh, drill index is three quarters. So I'm going to say, you know what? That's the biggest one. Anything over three quarters, I'm going to interpolate. So don't even worry about creating a hole geometry for that. So I'm going to go ahead and click OK. Let me delete all of those. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of the tool pass that were created. Heck, I'll even get rid of the tools. Why not? So start from scratch. So I'm going to go ahead and run AFR again. Oh. And now we can see that it went ahead and ignored that big, crazy three inch hole. So this is a really good way to narrow down the results of automatic feature recognition. If you have any questions about automatic feature recognition or hole man manager in general, please feel free to reach out to your local reseller or contact Gibbs Camp Technical Support. Thank you.